What's up guys, welcome back to another Dokkan Battle video. So, it wasn't easy, but over the past couple of months, I've managed to once again save up a bunch of stickers, and today, we're gonna do another one of those, uh, I guess, sticker application videos and do a live reaction to all the different effects we're gonna see. Now, for the most part, I have no idea what any of these effects will look like because I didn't look through the entire catalog like some people did, so this should be a nice surprise. And in terms of the units we're actually giving stickers to, most of them will be units that I either use a lot or I just really like, but I did get a few recommendations. So we will be giving stickers to uh, AGL Rosé, apparently Fizz Berserk Kale looks really dope as well, and uh, also Fizz Piccolo and the AGL Android 13. So with all that said, let's jump right into it. And the plan here is to do 10 stickers in total. I do have 13 stickers, but I want to save some for, you know, future units that come out that I want to have stickers on immediately. Like, uh, for example, if they decide to drop a Dokkan Fest Android 18 on us out of nowhere, a global first Android 18 maybe, then I want to make sure I have that sticker ready for her as soon as possible, right? So uh, yeah, 10 stickers is the plan. And we're definitely not giving one to this guy because I don't think he deserves it. No offense to... Super Saiyan 3 Broly fans out there, but why don't we start with uh, a recommendation, hopefully, you know, a good way to start the video, if his effect is nice, the AGL Rosé. Now, I don't use him too much, but he does have a special place in my heart, so let's do it, man. I mean, it's Rosé. Like, what's the worst that can happen? All right, here we go. Please be good. Okay, okay, you know what? That's kind of... That's kind of clean. That's kind of clean. No, I was expecting like something a little bit more crazy, but I mean, it's just very, I guess clean is the right word, right? Cause like, I really like the subtle like black aura around him and uh, also the pulsing from like the energy ball in his hand. Um, that stupid diamond black background is still there, still ruining the art a little bit, but it's not too, it's not too notice noticeable, you know? And uh, yeah, I like it. I like it. It's not my favorite, I'll be honest. I still think that the STR Omega, as well as the uh, Tech Vegito Blue, like those guys are in a tier of their own, but this is, this is solid. This is good. Okay, so I don't regret that. Now, let's check out another one that some people have told me is uh, definitely worth, which is the Fizz Kale. Now, she is a monster. I do... I mean, I don't run her too much, actually, but I, I think she's worth it. I think she's worth it, so let's go with uh, a sticker on her as well. Come on. Oh, yeah, okay, okay, okay. I like that, I like that. Um, it's kind of focused on just, like, the ball in the middle, and, you know, any unit with, like, some kind of a ball or... <laughs> that sounded wrong. Any unit with, like some kind of a concentrated energy ball, you know, in their art usually looks pretty good. Like for example, the Beerus, like he has that huge uh, ball like above him and like that's where most of the effects go to and that looks really clean. So kind of a similar thing here too. Um, I do wish they did more with her background, honestly, but it's not too bad. She is a beast, so that's cool, that's cool. All right, so now I'm gonna do one that I've really wanted to see, and I feel like it's gonna be really disappointing because, um, I mean, mainly because like the new Dokkan Fest units, they don't seem to put a lot of effort into the sticker effects, you know? Like they just kind of throw it in there to like give them one, but they've all pretty much been very disappointing. And it seems like the best ones usually have the worst effects, you know, like the Tech Gohan, his effect is terrible, man. Same thing with uh, STR. STR Cooler, like, let me show you, man, STR Cooler has, like, the lamest sticker effect, like, that's all it is, you know, for a unit that's so, it's powerful, that's so strong, like, they, they could have done more for him, you know, but it is what it is, it is what it is, so, uh, I, I feel like it's gonna be disappointing, but obviously he's a beast, obviously he's a unit that, uh, I mean, his banner treated me very nicely, I'm talking about this guy right here, the Int Legendary Super Saiyan Broly. Um, so just because of that, because I was able to rainbow him on the first banner, 
I think I gotta throw a sticker on him. So uh, even if he ends up being disappointing, hey, at the very least I can get that like little glow on his like thumbnail art, right? Like when he's on my team. Oh yeah, okay. It's exactly what I thought. This, it, you know, sometimes like you, you say something negative just to kind of uh, help yourself not be disappointed when, when the disappointment happens, when it actually comes, and that's what I was doing with this guy, right? Because I was like, you know, trying to control my expectations, trying to, you know, downplay him a little bit just so I wouldn't be that upset. But yeah, his effect sucks, man. I mean, <laughs> what can I say? They could have at least done like some kind of swirl in um in his hand, right? Like that's just lazy. That's just lazy. That's that's exactly the issue with the cooler. Literally the same thing. It's literally just like the radiating like light pulse thing, you know, kind of like a uh, some of those lights that you see on like a Christmas tree or something. I mean. Yeah, that sucks. Well, like like I said, at least I get that little like shine now. So if I if I don't want to look at the art, it still makes me happy to see that little like shine, you know, when I have him on my team. So <laughs> whatever, man. I'll get over it. I'll get over it. Okay, another unit that um, I recently rainbowed that uh, I have a lot of respect for for sure. I mean, Bardock. This guy is one of my favorite units in the entire game because he's one of my favorite characters in the franchise. If not. On the top of my, I don't know, man. Sometimes he, he's my favorite. Sometimes it's Gogeta. Like I kind of go back and forth a lot, so I'm not really sure right now. But Bardock is definitely up there. So I mean, the only Dokkan fits Bardock in the game. He's got to get a sticker. Here we go. I'm ready for the disappointment, though. Although it is two two for one, right? It is a two for one situation. Okay, he looks better than Broly. <laughs> I'll give him that. He looks better than Broly, not by a lot, but definitely better than Broly. Now, as I said, two for one, so we have the Super Saiyan Bardock. Hopefully that one's a little bit less um, toned down, I guess. Oh, okay, you know what? There's two effects here, right? There's the there's the circular swirl effect and then the, you know, like the up and down, like aura effect as well. I like that. I like that. It's kind of like the rosé effect, you know, kind of subtle, not too crazy, but clean. So, hey, yo, I got my money's worth, man. I got my stickers worth, because it's two arts, it's two effects for the price of one. So, I'm not going to complain about that one either. Now, what else should we do? Uh, I did say Fizz Piccolo, right? Fizz Piccolo was a recommendation. I'm not really sure why. Um, but I do see like a lot of those like jagged lines, like the green lightning thing on his art. So, like, maybe... They do something really cool with that, and the aura too, right? He has the green aura in his art, so maybe it's like the green aura and also the the green lightning, like all getting effects at the same time. I can see that being, you know, pretty cool. Uh, okay, okay, let's do it. Fizz Piccolo never run this guy, but he is a very solid tank. So uh, he's only he's the only Dokkan Fizz Piccolo too. So oh, okay, all right. Uh, it, it is the lightning effect for sure. They could have done something with his aura, though. They could have done, like, the same thing with Goku Black. Yeah, instead of the, the purple, you know, with Goku Black, they could have done, like, a green glow around this guy, too. That's that's a missed opportunity, guys. Oh, actually, hold on. He's also a two-for-one. He is also a two-for-one. So, uh, <laughs> let's see what the other Piccolo art looks like here. Boom. Not bad. Not bad. Okay, that's much better, actually. Significantly better than the untransformed Piccolo. Um, although this one's, like, decent too, actually. I would give him, like, a 6.5 out of 10. You know, like, a passing grade. He doesn't pass by a lot, but he does pass. You know, like, if I were to give Cooler a 4, like, he fails. Okay, Cooler failed. But Piccolo gets a passing. A passing. <laughs> Piccolo gets a pass. Piccolo gets a pass. All right, so I'm, I'm going to be straight with you guys, man. These recommendations have not really worked out too well. Um, I might stop taking recommendations altogether if things go keep going this way. The last recommendation I did get was uh, one that I wouldn't have thought of myself, you know, like because he, he's not like my favorite unit. Like he's fine. He, he's good, but 
Uh, it's the Android 13. It's the AGL Android 13. I can't even find him right now. Uh, did I rainbow him? I thought I rainbowed him recently, but maybe not. Uh, oh, there he is. Okay, so he is not rainbowed. He's at 79%. I only run him on Androids, obviously. Um, but... Yeah, hey, look, this guy gets, like, no respect from other people. So we're gonna be the one to show him some respect. Hopefully he pays us back in a good effect here. That's kind of cool. That's kind of cool. Okay. Okay, I like I like what they did there with the various components. Okay. Um, that's actually a really cool effect. Because it, it, unlike the other lights that we normally get, like the lazy ones, like this one actually kind of looks like... Uh, it kind of, kind of looks like a jet of like, oh, it would, like it's just like an air jet, right? It, it's got like more going on because it's not just like a light pulsing; it's also kind of like wavy. So, yeah, it's pretty cool. It's pretty cool. Now he's also a two for one, so we're getting good value at least for these stickers here. So let me see what the Super Android 13 looks like now. All right, transformation, Fusion Android 13. Uh, oh, very similar to the Bardock. Okay, solid, solid. Pretty much the same thing as the Bardock, actually. Like, even the, even, like, the cut-in, like, jagged lines, the, the little, you know, the spikes are the same. Then we got the, the aura in the back. Um, and also, actually, no, a few lightning effects, too. I missed that. We got the, the pink lightning, too. Although, it's not really moving, it's just kind of glowing. But, okay, I don't mind that. I don't mind that. Um... Sadly, there hasn't been anything today that's like kind of blown me away, you know? Like a few that did really like wow me when I first saw it was like the uh Let me show you guys one that I really like. Um, where's the cooler? The end cooler man has a really really dope effect. Uh, if I can find him here. Hold on, let me filter by int extreme. Uh there he is. Okay, this guy right here. Look at that. Look how clean that effect looks, man. I mean, it might it might be just something to do with his art too, but like they absolutely killed this one, man. And that's just so nice to look at. And I could just stare at this for like 10 minutes. But uh, yeah, unfortunately, he's not a Dokkan. I mean, it, it kind of feels like they actually give sticker effects to... Oh, whoa, hold on. Okay, I'm gonna finish my thought. They give sticker effects to... Uh, like better sticker effects to non Dokkan Fest units compared to Dokkan Fest. I don't know why, but it just seems that way sometimes. But uh, with that said, I can't believe I didn't give Int Android 18 a sticker. What am I doing? Am I crazy? That's my girl right there, man. Like, I, people are gonna start calling me a fake fan. <laughs> people are gonna start, start calling me a fake Android 18 fan. I can't have that happen. We're gonna give her a sticker immediately. I'm sorry. That's my bad. And hey, she's clean. <laughs> she's she's actually pretty clean. <laughs> I mean, I was gonna give it to her one way or the other, right? That came out completely wrong. That that's not what I meant. I was gonna give her the sticker, regardless of what the what the effect looked like. But I'm glad that it looks pretty pretty dope, you know. So it, it's kind of a double win. Like on the one hand, it's Android 18, so that's a win. On the other hand, her effect is dope, so that's that's a double win. Okay, so that's out of the way. Uh, how many stickers do we have left? Okay, we're gonna use three more. We're gonna use three more. Um, oh, yo, before I forget, I gotta give this guy a sticker. Uh, Super Saiyan 4 Gogeta, man. Super Saiyan 4 Gogeta. It was actually really hard to not give him one as soon as I got him, but I, I knew eventually I was gonna do this video, so I had to save it. Now, his art is really clean. And hey, yeah, that that does not disappoint, man. That does not disappoint. It's not as good as Tech Super Saiyan 4 Gogeta. Let me be clear about that, okay? Even though he's a much much better unit, like far superior to the Tech Super Saiyan 4, his effect is not as good. But it's definitely one of the better ones we've seen today. You know, it, it's it's definitely one of the cleaner ones we've seen today. I mean, compare this to the tech one, um, I think it's pretty obvious who wins in that department. But the tech one, like, as I said, has that big ball, right? He has that, like, 
big blast. So that's part of the reason, or the main reason why he he looks better to me at least. But they 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 did the the int one well well too. You know, they did did him justice at the very least. Like we got the aura going, we got the swirl going. Um, I kind of like how it frames him. You know, like he's in the, at the middle of like all the swirls. So that's kind of cool. Um, yeah, I, I'm gonna say does not disappoint. Definitely doesn't. Okay. So now we got how many left? We got two left. I really want to find one that just like blows me away, but I don't know if we can today, you guys. I mean, this guy could be good. I mean, he, he's got that crazy blue aura behind him, so. Yeah, I, I really like this Vegeta. I love his super attack animation, even though it's like outdated. It's just like, I love how he pummels the enemy into the ground. So, oh, okay, yes. <laughs> That's what I'm talking about. Yo, that, that's what I'm talking about. Okay, we found one. We found one. Yo, that is, that, that is what, you know, you know, like exactly what I was looking for, man. It, it's one of those arts that actually looks as good as some LR animations out there, you know, like LR arts out there. Um, that aura is just, that aura is just too nice, man. And, and I like how it's not going crazy either, you know, like I don't like the auras that go like super fast Like this one is kind of uh, Medium speed, I guess it's not like two times speed. It's one point. It's one point uh, five times speed I can't even talk right now, man. This card got me too excited This art got me too excited, dude He looks awesome That that looks awesome yeah, Guys if you got a, a spare sticker Okay, make sure to apply it to your Super Saiyan Blue Vegeta cuz not only is he a great unit, he also looks sick, man, with the sticker effect. That's the best one by far today. No question. That 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 is the best one we've seen so far. They've kind of been a little bit disappointing, if I'm being completely honest, but I think the SSB Vegeta made up for it. And and it's interesting too, because the uh, AGL Super Saiyan Blue Evolution Vegeta has literally one of the uh, best sticker effects in the entire game too. And I guess somebody just really likes Super Saiyan Blue Vegeta. I mean, look at this. Look at that, like that's crazy, right? And they kind of took what they did with the aura here and applied it to the Int Super Saiyan Blue Vegeta. But Super Saiyan Blue Vegeta also has the, uh, the, the spiky things, right? So it's kind of like, Double the effect compared to the other one like like the AGL Super Saiyan Blue evolution is great, but I think this one's even better Yeah, that's sick. Okay one last one this one. I think will be Disappointing, but we are getting two for one once again, and he's also about to get the craziest extremes the awakening for the anniversary, so I think It's worth you know regardless of whether it looks good or not uh, I will be very, very disappointed if it's, you know, not so nice, but his EZA will make up for it. You know, just how stupidly overpowered they're going to make him with that EZA. I think it's justified. So here we go. We're going to give a sticker to Int UI Goku in preparation for his upcoming EZA for the anniversary. And, uh, yeah, it's right. It's right. But MUI though, MUI though, please make up for it, please make up for it, ooh, I like that aura a lot, yo I like that aura a lot, that's clean, yeah okay, that's worth it, that's worth it, I, I can't wait until this guy actually becomes playable again, <laughs> I mean, not to say he's not playable right now, it's just like he's not that good anymore but dude once he gets that easy a we're gonna be running him all the time so uh this this sticker application will pay off it, it definitely will pay dividends in the future so yeah there you go guys that is our sticker application video number two or three i forgot the number but um we're gonna save the last three as i said for an upcoming dokkan fest that i want to make sure i have a sticker on immediately namely like an android 18 if they surprise us probably not but Man can dream, and uh, I guess we'll leave things off on. We're gonna leave it off on this guy because he he had the best effect. Let's be honest. 
And uh, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed the video, man. As always, if you liked today's video, then make sure to like the damn video. Oh, definitely leave me some suggestions for uh, stickers to, you know, use in the future or units to give stickers to in the future. Um, because, you know, we're going to be doing more of these as well once I get another 10 stickers. And uh, yeah, if you like the video, like the damn video. If you're new here, sub to the channel. Hit that notification bell so that YouTube knows you want to stay up to date with all my latest content. And that's it. I'm out of here until next time. Hope you guys have a fantastic, fantastic day. I'm Tiger with Tiger Uppercut Media. Signing out.